What do you call that scary moment when you realize you won't fit in the chimney? Santa Claustrophobia. Welcome, <clears throat> the shaven butcher for a winter shave. Got a pretty, or a Christmas shave rather. Got a pretty bad cold, um, fever, uh, coughing, <clears throat> nose running. Um, Le Mafioso is going to be the soap of the day and I do have the matching aftershave splash. The razor is made by Matti Lindholt. He made this three-piece racer. I've got a Astra SP blade in it. And that's about it. Well, the brush is the horsey brush from Zenith. It's been soaking. So yeah, <clears throat> we were going to have a biggish uh, group of people to celebrate Christmas, family and and yeah, only family, and uh, one got COVID, so that took out one entire family, and then um, most of us <coughs> here have a cold, might be COVID, don't know, we're not going out, just in case. So, very, very peaceful Christmas, just the way I like it. You know, I, don't, I don't mind having a bit of a cold, means I can get a peace, peaceful Christmas. So it's Christmas Eve today, which is the, the big day of celebrations in, in Sweden. I don't know why, but it's, it's uh, all the Nordic countries. Let's see if I have enough here. All the Nordic countries and possibly a few others as well have the 24th Christmas Eve as the big Christmas Christmas thing, whereas most of the world it's the it's the twenty fifth, right? So who knows? Anyway, that's how we do it. So we had there were stockings in the morning. Maybe I need more soap. You know, with Hendrix. Uh, I feel I need to load a bit longer than with other soaps. Not a problem. Just, you know, something to keep in mind. Yeah, we're getting more suds out of this one now. Looking pretty good. So stockings. Even I got a stocking. And then we have porridge for breakfast what do you call it um, uh, it's getting scratched in Swedish it's uh, actually uh, it's rice and, uh, okay I'm not going to that and anyway <laughs> porridge with an almond in so whoever gets the almond um, and then we argue what that person has to do. Either that person is getting married or has to come up with a rhyme or will get a wish granted. We don't quite know, but we put the damn thing in every year. Uh, I got it this year, so I don't know if I hope. I hope they've forgotten already. I think my wife just likes to put it in. This morning, you can say for all wives. So next, next order of business will be luncheon. I think around one o'clock, where it's ham, uh, something called Jonsson's Temptation, <laughs> that you will know if you're Swedish. Um, potatoes, you know, sliced potatoes, bits of onion, um, anchovies in a mix with lots of butter and cream. So I make that and I make the ham and then meatballs, ribs, 
and a honey glazed ribs. Typically different kinds of cabbage. We'll, we'll have bris, bris, Brussels sprout because we like that. Uh, salmon, different kinds of salmon and oh yeah, uh, pickled herring. For every single big event in Sweden, we eat pickled herring. It's unbelievable. Most people don't like it. I think it's okay. My family loves it. So pickled herring. Christmas, um, Easter, midsummer parties, uh, pickled herring. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Rest of the year, we don't touch the stuff. And, you know, things like that. Probably a few other things. There's going to be a, a big spread where, you know, we all, we were all going to contribute to the real food. Of course, that's not happening. So we're eating our, what we were supposed to bring. So that's, that's that. And then at <clears throat> three o'clock, <laughs> We watch since the 50s or 60s, it's a tradition to watch uh, <laughs> short segments of like adverts, <clears throat> the, or, or, yes, short scenes from old and new Disney movies. Very odd tradition. So we refer to it as Donald Duck, although he plays a very small part. <clears throat> but that's what it's called. So we do that, and then after that, at four o'clock or five, it's typically Christmas present time. And then the rest of the evening, you play with your presents and you watch television. Typically the, the exact same TV programs that show every year. Uh, because it's tradition and that's the way we like it at least i do i don't think i'm extremely an extremely traditional person but christmas is one of those where i want it to be the way it's always been oops It's okay. I think maybe I need a new blade. But I'm not going to bother with it. Good little razor this, or not so little. Long handle, which I like. Brilliant knurling, or whatever you call that. So the grip is, is terrific. What do you do for Christmas? What's your tradition? That's a long, that's a big question. It's interesting, you know, because you're from different parts of the world and some of you won't celebrate Christmas. You heathens. You know, <clears throat> Jesus and, and everything. It's all a, a big commercial jippo, isn't it? But, you know, what the heck. So, it's the four of us. My, both my kids uh, live on their own, but they come home for Christmas, and this is actually the first Christmas where the young boy has his own place, and he's he's had a tree for a month. He was the first one to put up a tree. Uh, but now, now they're home, and he's the only one who isn't sick <clears throat> yet, and. 
Christmas Day is a big is the big homecoming day. So you, you come home to the families in your where where you grow up typically and the twenty fifth the young the young ones go out and big party party day. <clears throat> so we're all trying to stay away from him so he won't get sick so he can get out. Yeah. Good shave. Even when you're feeling unwell, <clears throat> it's nice to nice to get a shave in, clean up a bit. Plus, it is Christmas. Okay, off to shave. <coughs> I can't smell. <laughs> I can't. I can't smell anything. But this is this is the soap. It's a top note of cardamom, and then mid middle notes are iris and lavender. I think. And then you have these notes of. Ah, uh, trying to remember. Woodsy notes. Uh, uh, oh, I can't remember. I can smell a little bit, not much though, <clears throat> but a little bit. I know it smells good, so the rest of the family will, will enjoy. Thank you, Canadian Mafia and HSM, uh, what is it called? Hendrix, Hendrix Classic Shaving Company. <coughs> Gotta go lie down now, poor me. Happy Christmas to all of you if you celebrate it otherwise happy have a good weekend let's say thanks for watching we'll be back before the end of the year and uh, stay sharp